Don't forget to hit the like goal on every video that is released this week for an extra video. Gather around, sit down and let's all enjoy another dumb video. Guys, I'm here for some more Fire Emblem 8 and we're moving into chat. Wait, is this 8? I think so. Sacred Stones, whatever number that is. We're moving into chapter 17 where we're connecting up a few more paths and we're moving towards... Rouston, I think? Are we moving to Rouston? I think we're going towards Rouston. Let's go to Rouston. I also like how nearly every path that we've got back is getting blocked up apart from like this one main path to this tower place here. So, now before I get into it, apparently there's a way that I can check like... That I can apparently check like how people's support lines are going or like what supports I can have or so I don't know how to do that. Mur is so strong. Okay, let's just go. Let's just go. Let's move to the Narimble River or whatever it is. <coughs> the sacred stones that defeated the Demon King radiate a constant and dazzling light. The sacred stones are the only power against the dark and the last hope of humanity. It is only natural that evil would seek to destroy the sacred stones. There can be no other force behind this attempt to gain the stones. A childhood friend appears before Erica. Leon? Leon? Are you gonna join us, Leon? Please join us! Please join us! Please join us in a baseball bat! Two years ago? How do you intend to use the sacred stone, Leon? Do you really think you can tap into its power? Mm, my research isn't complete yet, but there's no mistaking the power the sacred stone contains. And the sacred stone of Grado seems especially responsive to my dark magic. I suppose it's because it contains both sacred and demonic properties. Regardless, if I can just press my studies a little harder, well, I think I might be able to use it to heal my father's illness. That works, there's no telling how many other people I can help as well. Do you think this is wise? The power contained within the stone is beyond our understanding. My father tells me that the stones possess a power not to be trifled with. Uh-huh, Father McGregor is also against it. That's why they still won't give me direct access to the Stone of Grado. For the time being, I may do with the radiant energy surrounding it. There's nothing compared to the raw power of the stone itself, but... If I can show Father McGregor some real progress, perhaps one day? Using the sacred stones to study magic. Ephraim, Erica, what do you two think? Using the divine power of the sacred stones in this way? You don't think it's a very good idea, do you? It's just that I know nothing at all of magic. I would that there were some way I could help you, but I simply can't. That made no sense. But Leon, I've seen how hard you've worked to help others. I know how much you want the power to make others happy. I know these things, and because I know you and I trust your intentions. Ephraim, I hope you use the power of the sacred stone for good. I trust you can. Aww, I'm behind you all the way. I agree with Ephraim entirely. You spend every night in the library studying cures for your father's illness. The power of the sacred stones is too powerful to be used for personal gain. For you, Leon, I think you'll be fine. You're the kindest person I know. Thanks, both of you. Hearing those words from you mean a lot to me. Actually, this hasn't been made public yet, but I've already saved someone using the knowledge I've gleaned so far. You have? Uh-huh. A while back, a fire ravaged Seraphew, and a little girl got trapped in the flames. Her burns were terrible. Not even healing staves were able to cure her injuries. But... Just a sliver of the stone's power restored her life and healed her wounds. We said that cause life in her. Oh, if you could have seen the tears of joy in her mother's eyes. You really did it, huh? You really are special, Leon. Congratulations. Well, thanks, but there's still so much more to be done. I am happy, though. To be honest, I just want to help people. I, um, yep. I want to put the ancient magics to use for the common good. That's how I feel. Leon. And as my research moves forward, I'll be able to do much more too. We have only the barest understanding of how dark magic operates. 
Maybe we can use it not only to heal wounds, but also to stop diseases. What if we can read the future, predict disasters, move mountains? Hold on, Leon. You can't take too much when you shove at once. What good is helping people if you sacrifice yourself to do it? Oh, yes, of course. Sorry, I got carried away. You have a so soft heart, Leon. I bet you haven't taken any real time off. So this is what we're going to do. Today we're going into the city. And you're going with us, Leon. What? But Ephraim, you've got a history report due. We're taking today off. Come on, let's go. He's got a history report due. It's weird to think that there's like real stuff that goes on here. But, but Ephraim, it's just one day. I won't tell anyone. It wouldn't be fun for the three of us to spend a day together in the city. Ephraim, Erica, thanks so much. I'm lucky to have two of you as friends. Oh, Leon. We have the Stone of Reneus. The final sacred stone is in Ralston. Ladakau, can you tell us anything about the Stone of Ralston? Naturally. As Ralston's very own princess, I know a thing or two about our stone. The Palace Reliquary currently houses our sacred stone. Follow me, and I'll take you there. I sent the Fralian army ahead before us. They should be en route to Ralston. If we hurry, we can join up with them at the banks of the Narube River. Let's do it! Do not falter! Show them the might of Fralia! Oh! Go, Fralian! Kill him! No, my Fralian! Oh, the Fralians all died. Oh, the Fralians. Oh, the Fralians! They're trying so hard! Why? Why, my Fralian brothers and sisters? Oh, these just random people! Save the people! Oh no, this is a... Okay. Lady Cicere, the enemy is headed this way. Are you serious? Grado's been defeated and still they fight on. And they're tough. The Fralian fools have been wiped out by those guys. Oh no. Now we're finished as well. Everyone, please remain calm. If you panic and flee, the enemy will simply surround you. If you remain here and don't move, I promise to protect you all. Lady Serene. Lady Serene will save you! Brother, look there! A skirmish? Is that Serene? What's going on? We must go to her aid. Everyone, hold! Something evil is afoot! What do you mean? Leon! Leon? Leon! Erica! Ephraim! Leon! Where have you been all this time? Erica, stop! Brother! Leon! You met recently in Grado Keep, right? Do you remember what you told me then? You told me this was all you're doing. That you had started this war. What? Ephraim! Why are you so angry? We haven't seen each other in so long! What's happened? Leon! Wait, Erica! You said it yourself! Leon must be under the control of someone, or something else. Don't be ridiculous. There must be something wrong with you, Ephraim. Leon is one of our dearest and closest friends, remember? He told me that no matter what happened, he was still on our side. Isn't that right, Leon? Yes, Erica, of course it is. So please, come here. Closer. <coughs> Leon? <coughs> Stay back, Erica. What? Get away from me, quickly! If you don't, I will surely destroy you. What, Leon? Flee! Go quickly! Go! Go! Leon, hold on! What is it? What's happening? Hi! It's been a while since I saw you two last. Hasn't it? Leon? Is that really you speaking, Leon? Stay back, Erica. Keep your guard up, that's not Leon. Uh, I'm not Leon. That's rich. A masterpiece. You always thought Leon was kind, gentle, and weak, didn't you? Admit it. No, Leon and Erica and I were friends. There were things we kept to ourselves, of course, but we shared so much. No matter what happened, no matter how much time passed, we're still friends. Leon will never ever betray us, not in a million years. You're not Leon. Hmm. 
Looks like I was wrong to disregard the value of human emotions. What? I've had my fun pretending to be human, but the need for charades has passed. You are correct. This body no longer belongs to your young Leon. I devoured his pathetic heart ages ago. You monster, who are you? Do you really not know me? What a poorly uneducated prince. Think about it. Remember the legends of your pitiful kind. What was sealed within the stone of Grado? What is the name of terror? No, it can't be. It is we feared after all. That can only be. The great adversary of antiquity, the Demon King. <laughs> Leon, Leon, O oh Prince of Misery. Come out, be not shy. This body is lost to you, it is mine to compel. What's going? Your dreams, Leon, are about to make them come true for you. I'm about to crush Prince Ephraim and take Princess Erica for my own. Isn't that all you've ever art prayed for, young fool of a prince? Ah! Rejoice, Leon, the time has come, Ephraim, the man you envy, Erica, the woman you desire. I will now grant you all of your darkest wishes. Oh no. Okay, so we have to bring Erica and Ephraim for sure. I feel like... This is going to be a strong team of enemies. And I kind of want Ewan to sit back. I want Arthur to cut. I want everyone! Urgh. And it's that. Uh, wait. Because now I know that I can, like, check the map and stuff. So let's view the map. We've got some kids we and stuff we have to save. Do we have Bowman? We've already got a Pegasus Knight. So I feel we may not need another one. Got a vendor here, but at the same time, she is pretty helpful. I want to no, I want to pick my units. Thank you. Just being able to fly around so much, she is very helpful. But Garrick just became a hero, and I love Garrick, and I like Dusal, and I like Renak. I like all these characters, and I can't bring them along. So, like, I like Marissa, and I like Dozla, and I like Saleh. <laughs> There's too many characters, and I love Ewan! Ugh. I want Ewan to come, and I want Arthur to come. Natasha has to come, Arthur has to come, Deathies has to come, Luke, Josh, okay, this is our, this is our team this time. Okay, so here we go, we got our team, and I guess we'll, um... I don't know whether we want to rescue the people, or the, whether we just want to... Oh, I should have actually... I don't know. I don't know if we want to rescue the people, or if we want to... Like... Do something else. Not rescue... I don't know what I'm trying to say. I don't know whether we want to rescue them, or leave them alive. Uh, and then... Wait, was that a support line? Is that a support line for Natasha and Arthur? Whoa, 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 wait. Oh no, it was just a rescue. Okay. Arthur, let's get you up here. Everyone, get moving up. We need a strong line of... Uh... Offense? Defense? I don't know what the word is. Why, why can I use my staff? Did someone blow or something? What items do you have? You've got heal, thunder, hellfire, and a door key. You still got that door key, you know, just in case. But why could you use your star? I don't understand. Oh well, it's too late now. Okay, everyone's moving forward. Those guys have moved forward as well. Do you think that will kill her? I think Cyrene will hold them back. I hope Cyrene will hold them back. Okay. When it says star, who can you heal? Why is Thithi's already damaged? How is she already damaged? We just started! What? You can't actually reach her yet. Fifty, so how far up can you go? Ah. 
So she can only get to a point, because I want it to, so that he can talk to her. If I put him here, and wait, Arthur can just move up there and just see what happens. Now, Thethys, come on in. Uh, dance for our boy, Innes. See what happens. Innes now, move all the way. Okay, no, you can't make it anywhere near her. Well, what do we want to do? Does Cormag want to protect... Or help, help protect her. Because Cormac is strong. Cormac's a, Cormac is a strong character. I think he could take out a majority of the of the things that we have to deal with. We're gonna keep these little things alive. These little creatures alive and well. Now these guys look like they're gonna come in from behind, so we're gonna leave two strong guys kinda holding a back fort here. I guess Garrick's gonna move up here. Are these guys gonna try and traverse the water or I'm confused? Okay, and just wait there. Now let's see what happens. Oh I see, they broke that snag or whatever that said. I think they're trying to traverse the water, which is gonna take them a while, and of course these guys are all gonna try and attack Cormag. Cormag didn't kill, okay he killed one. They've all missed Cormag. Okay, Cormag, your steel lance broke, but that's okay. Because you've held off a lot of... Oh, you broke a snag as well. Shit. Okay, they're gonna... They're, they are gonna attack Cyrene, but Cyrene is okay. Cyrene is strong. Stronger than I expected. And now Cyrene is actually going to attack. She's killing these Nosferatu remnants pretty damn well. Good job. Good job. And more things have arrived. We just have to defeat the boss, right? Does that mean that... Wait, that didn't make a path, though, no, did it? Okay. Innes, can you talk... You can talk to her. Wait, who can you attack? Oh, you can attack the dragon dude. Nah, just talk to... Talk to Cyrene. Cyrene! Prince Innes, is it... Ah, it really is you, isn't it, Prince Innes? Being rescued by you is like a dream. Sorry, I need a status report. Oh, that's not his voice. Oh, oh yes. Please forgive me. The friendly troops we dispatched were ambushed and decimated. My squad is all that remains. So many dead. You can rest easy now, Cyrene. I'm here. Victory is assured. Let's go. Yes, sir, Prince Innes. Okay, so Erica, do you want to attack and kill this dragon dude? With what weapon? Just use that, I guess. You know, you're, you're able to take a little bit of damage, so that's fine. Where are these guys gonna come towards? I don't know whether it's worth letting Siren take a hit. As long as we hold off all the entrances, we'll be fine. So they are actually traversing over the water. And these guys here, they're coming in through my... Through the back. Okay, Luke. Uh, what we're gonna do... We have to think about this. We're gonna get... Vanessa sort of like up here and wait. Luke, you can hold sort of a back. Use your staff. Heal up Thethys, because for some reason Thethys is, is sore. Garrick, you stand there and wait. Thethys, you move up here. Dance for Natasha. There we go. Because it looks like we're going to have some assaults on some fronts here. And we need to hold true for our villages that are that we're protecting. And yeah, we just need to make sure that... Okay, they're going to attack Cormac and Erica. Well, this guy's going to attack either Cormac or Erica. So that is... Good. That is where we'll leave it. If these little people start running away from me, I'll be very upset as well, by the way. Okay, let's end that there. We're protecting the people. For once, we're going to save people's lives. But at the same time, Joshua is just dropping them. Here comes a remnant to attack Cormag. Cormag kills it. No problemo. Cormag levels up. So level 5 weapon lord, he is a lord. Oh, I see, they're attacking the- Oh shit, I didn't expect that! I didn't ex- I thought the snag had already broke! 
Okay, so they just are gonna keep coming, aren't they? They are, aren't they? I did not expect this to be as bad as it was. Or as bad as it's getting. Okay then. We need to use something that will just insta-kill. We got a guiding ring. Dope. Now where's this guy gonna move to? We are killing them. We definitely are killing them and that's positive. I'm thinking if Na Natasha can't rescue people. Okay. I need someone to rescue these guys because they're going to be attacked. I'm sure they're going to be attacked before. You've only got four aid. You've got 13 to 3. So yeah, rescue this little dude. And then just stand your ground. Cormac. Rescue this guy here, and then stand your ground. And his rescue... No, you don't have much rescue. Siren, rescue this guy here, and then stand your ground. We are going to be standing ground rather than attacking, because it's just a little bit more safe. Rescue the river folk. And now stand your ground here, I guess. For him. Dance for Garrick. Great job. Garrick, go up and attack this thing here. We just need you to one shot it. So, whatever you use to one shot, use it. Great job, Garrick. Great job. We got the Vilven Vilter. Okay, so that closes off their pathway. This guy here, he can move up and attack. I think this is okay for now, so let's end that there. I think that's an okay assessment. Oh! I didn't realize how low Joshua was! Oh shit! And of course, but no, Ephraim drops them. Okay, so we need Natasha to go and heal up. Oh, and I didn't realize how much damage they would do to, to Cyrene! I thought she'd be strong against things like- So this is the end, Vanessa. <sighs> See, like, that doesn't make sense. How am I supposed to know that they're gonna do lots of damage to, to Cyrene? How, how do you expect me to know that? Just kill it. We need all these things dead. I need this thing dead. What's the Saigon Lion do? Nothing. Cormac, what will you do against this guy? <sighs> Shit! I'm fucked. I'm genuinely fucked. I thought I was doing so well, and then wow, wow. Great job. Come up and heal our boy Joshua, please. Mend him up. Can you kill her, please? Thank you. I'm a little bit upset now. My guys are running out of items. I need to supply them with more trash. How close up can Fifi's get? Just thinking. So if I got Ephraim to go up there and wait and then dance for Ephraim, please. Then Ephraim can attack this guy, right? Kill him. Kill him! Great job. Cormag can kill this dude, I hope. No, nope. he doesn't have anything to... Okay. Can we just supply... No, I want you to... Oh, yes, I'd have to... Let me think. 
Okay, go on, go on, Mer, kill it. Be the dragon you are born to be. Now, access the supply. Give yourself. Get no, give it the fire. Take. Old Hilma. Now trade with him. What can he use? Can he use the Odd Hilma? No. Can he use that? Okay. Can we can we trade that as well? She's got a lot of strong weapons. I think we need to also supply. Give uh no take her just like an uh, another iron sword as well. And that's gonna be your turn there, I think. You still can't kill anyone with anything. Cool mag. And you missed. Cool mag, buddy. How? You're killing me here. How many more are we gonna keep arriving? Is this gonna be a common occurrence of enemies arriving and are they just gonna keep pouring out? I don't wanna deal with that. I think they are. I think they're legitimately gonna keep pouring out. How are you going, Garrick? You could drag... Oh, whoops. You can drag one of these guys out here. I genuinely think I'm gonna lose this round because... We got a Brave Axe, cool. Because they keep on just pouring in. And my guys are running out of weapons and oh, I was not prepared, I might be screwed. Oh dear, let's uh... And the Zambato broke. Shit. Okay. So we just gotta think wisely about this because... You know, it's important to keep everyone alive. Can we get Natasha up here? And then dance for Natasha. And then Natasha, get up here and staff mend up Ephraim. Okay, here we go. Now, Erica, can you kill this thing with anything? Anything, I'm, I'm begging you. Well, that's why we have the Manchete, because the Manchete is overpowered and she can kill things. Unlike my other guys that apparently are bad at killing things. If I'm a few attack with just a steel lance, you'll kill it right. There we go, great job, if I'm. Is that lady dead? Yeah, she died. She's dead. She didn't stand a chance. Okay, cool. Whatever. I need to use something that you got a high hit chance with. But apparently, you don't have much of those. Take. What? Oh, right. Wait, why is it green though? Give the hand axe, take a... We're running out of swords, we actually need to... What, what, why is it green for taking? Take it back! Wait, that was weird. Okay, Cool Mag, you'll be okay, right buddy? Oh, Cool Mag, you took a bit of damage. Okay, and they did attack Garrick like I thought they might. Good, okay. Now, the, the thing that I want to do is I want to put Garrick in a spot that... Mm. So Cormac just needs to fly back and wait so that Natasha can mend him up. There is the shot here. Ford should be able to take these two guys on if, uh, if we just let Joshua go shopping. Right? If I just put Ford there, he'll be able to take them on when they try to assault him. I don't want Garrick by himself. 
I don't want Garrick by himself, but, you know, Garrick's gonna do well. I think Garrick will be fine. Now, the thing is, we want to take out these two, these two guys up here without anyone else getting majorly damaged. And we want to take these two guys out here. I think we'll be okay. I think at this rate, I think we're gonna, gonna be okay. My god, was I a little bit nervous though. I think we've, we've taken out a majority of the guys. Unless, like, we get a giant... Oh, Natasha! Oh, I did not realize that you would get attacked. Garrett's gonna drag two of them out. Or Ephraim will. Shit, this is getting bad. This is getting really bad for my team. Just use your vulnerability there, Ford. And just wait there. I think, I, I think those guys are gonna keep on coming. Vinda. No, fuck you! What do you mean? What do you mean you don't... I wasted all that time. Are you serious right now? Arthur, you got the sword, right? Yeah, you got a steel sword. Let's go. Let's go. Wait there. That's upset me. I'm upset. Luke, you go over to here. Do things you can't get to loot. Uh... How much health does this thing have? Full. We have to get Mur killing these guys then. Erica, wait. Formag. Natasha, do you have items? You do have vulnerabilities. Use your damn vulnerability, girl. Now, we could have the problem of them wanting to attack Ephraim. That could be a massive, pro a major, major problem. But they could also try to attack Garrett. Uh, use your item vulnerability again if you're not full health there, girl. Let's end that there for now. See what happens. Okay, I thought... Okay, two went for Ephraim, one went for Garrick. That is... Okay by me, I think. Because this time now, loot is also by his side. Arthur, you're gonna make your way with the team now. Dr oh wait, no! Arthur was... Fuck. These things, dance for Arthur. Dance for him, please. So that he can go back to Joshua and trade with him so that he can have a steel sword. Why do you have all these things? What does this even do? An amulet that protects flyers from arrows. Oh, okay then. Ford, you also just pull back. We're gonna we're gonna make the path that those guys have to take quite a bit longer. Good job, Garrick. We got some Oh, they both attack Natasha. Oh my god, this is just getting disgustingly bad. Natasha, we seriously need you, like, out of this sort of area ASAP. Mur is gonna... Mur is gonna be killing a lot of things by the looks of it. I need you in a spot where you won't be attacked by pretty much anything. you kill it? No, you're not gonna kill it. You're not good enough to kill it. Fuck. Yeah, use your steel bow. Kill it. Okay, Ephraim. Ephraim, can you just come up here and kill him? Sigmund. 21 times by 2. That doesn't work out. We've only got that one spot. Wait there, so that Thithis can dance for you, Cormag, because 
Sweet. Wait, so what was it? It was... Wait, let me look. Uh, if we attack with the Seigmund, it's 21 times 2, so he'd still have 2 health. And then he'd do a whole bunch of damage. Please kill him! Please, I just want this over! Wesleyon, what have you done with our friend? Answer me! <laughs> what a splendid fool you make! Shall I dress you in a jester's cap? Shall we watch you jape in my demon's court? Leon is dead! I devoured him, can you not understand? Monster! Come on, Ephraim, just crit kill him, crit kill him, crit kill him! You're gonna. No. You didn't crit kill him. Oh well, that's okay, Ephraim. That's okay, sometimes we can't, we can't succeed. No, 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 no! No, 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 cancel everything! Ephraim's dead. There's no way I can save Ephraim, is there? <gasps> there is. What would attacking do? There could be a chance for him's death. 70, 65. Do we risk killing him, or do we save him? Do we save Ephraim? Or do we heal up Ephraim? I could risk- I could risk attacking, but then someone will die if she misses twice. I think we're gonna- we're gonna risk attacking. Here we go. Do you challenge me? You humans are so inconsistent. You've forgotten what it is to fear me. Loot! Please kill him! Okay, you did it, Loot. <laughs> you did it, Loot. You killed the the, 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 the the beast. You deserve that level up. And we got a Nosferatu. Just send it. Send the brave axe. Send something. Wait, is he running away? Ugh. Bah! Don't hold up to such as this. Because it's human flesh is too brittle, too weak. Wait! We're all here! Hold, Leon! Now I know your strength, it is time to leave! I sacrifice this flesh in return to my body of old. This does not end. The world will drown in darkness again! No! We will not let him. We will not let you flee! After America! We have to find where he's gone! Search everywhere! I can't allow him to desecrate my friend's body any longer! Erica! Prince Ennis! No need to panic, my soldiers pursue Prince Leon's trail. Our trackers are excellent, they'll have him soon. Good! There's something I need to speak with you about. The messenger I sent to Freya returned not long ago. She bought a package I'd requested, Freilia's Sacred Twins. Do you have the Sacred Twins? Yes, Freilia may have lost her Sacred Stone. However, it seems the Sacred Twin relics remained undisturbed. I had them brought here. Behold! These! Freilia's Sacred Twins. Nidhogg the Serpent Bow and Vidvenfringer the Wind Lance. I want you to take them. No, you can have the bow! These are for you, aren't they? They're for the rulers of Freilia. No, I entrust them to your care. You're the leader of this army, use them as you see fit. Thank you, Prince Innes. I appreciate your sacrifice. It is no sacrifice, I require no thanks. We're fighting for the same thing here. Victory. So we got Nidhogg, which is, he's gonna be... Oh, okay, we, we're sending it to the, okay, and we're gonna send the Devil Axe. Oh, well once again we got a new character and lost a new character. I don't think we, I can handle new characters anymore because I don't understand how strong they are and everything like that and so, you know, you try and test them out and then a character just flies in and kills them in like one or two shots and it's like, what do you want me to do? What do you expect of me? You know, you give me this new character. I want them to be strong. I want them to be overpowered. I want them to actually be able to play against the other characters that I'm fighting. But it doesn't work like that. They're just weak and get killed. It's frustrating. So I think from here on out, our team that we have is the team we're going to have. And anyway guys, that is where I'm going to leave it for this episode of Fire Emblem 8. Guys, you get so close to 15 likes on these videos. So keep it up. I really appreciate it. Guys, keep it up. We'll be getting extra videos. 
So anyway guys, thank you so much for watching, I'll see you in the next episode of Whatever I Make. Stay safe fam, see ya!